Since I got to use a digital bollocks for my band's most recent promo video, I decided to perform an experiment to see if I can get it to play nice with an Atomos Ninja 2, and turns out I can. Unfortunately, when I ran both at 24p, I got glitches every few seconds, but if I set the HDMI output on the D16 to 60i and the recording format to 60i, then all of a sudden it worked nicely. Now the camera is still running at 24p, but it's repeating a frame every four frames, so it comes out 30p. And if you look at this video, it's not the best camera work ever because I was using a 28mm lens that was handheld and I was just basically messing around on my lunch break. But the net result is you can actually get a pretty good image just recording to the Atomos Ninja, and it's certainly good enough to do an offline edit while you have the video transcoding on another computer for the best quality. You could also easily set up a script to convert back to 24p so you could use this video for the actual online edit, but I wouldn't recommend that because you're really selling yourself short by not going through the raw process. Anyway, I hope this helps. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe.